Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I think that I am officially in labor, I think. Um, I've been having contractions pretty consistently since 12.30 this morning. Um, it's April 23rd, it is 7.06 a.m. right now. Um, so I've been up pretty much since 12.30 this morning. I started timing them at 1.52 a.m. And they've pretty much been about eight to 10 minutes apart, but I have had some that are like 20 minutes, like 15 minutes apart. So I'm just like, am I really in labor? And like lately, they haven't been too far apart, but they have, so I don't know. Like the longest one I had was at 6.36, it was 19 minutes apart, but then it went to 16 and then it went to seven and then like three. But it's like, if I'm sitting down, they're pretty consistent. But once I start getting up and moving, I think all the pressure, then they kind of start to come more back to back where they like stop. So I don't know, but I think, I think it might be it. So yeah, um, I literally just like woke up Brandon right now to let him know because we still have stuff that we like need to do that hasn't been done yet. And um, I need him to like run to the grocery store really quick to grab a couple things before we like have to head out to the hospital so that Jasmine and Belle and my mom are good. Um, we still need to install the car seat into the car, which will take all of two seconds, but yeah, so I'm just gonna take you guys along with me um, today because maybe it's gonna be the day, but I don't know. Also, we have our carpets getting cleaned today at 11 a.m. So I'm like, am I really in labor? Should I call the guy and tell him not to come? But then I'm like, my mom will be here. So if we did need to still get them done, I'm sure, you know, it would be fine. But I'm just like, I feel like just there's like so many things. But all right, um, I'm trying to think of what I'm going to do right now. Oh, I need to put my nurse's baskets together. So I'm going to do that and show you guys like everything that I got and then put those together really quickly. We could probably do that. And I think I'm getting a con contraction right now. Alright, so yeah, that was another one. So my last one was four minutes and 45 seconds ago. So yeah, I don't know. But um, yeah, but I think I was saying um, I still need to put my nurse's baskets together. So um, maybe we'll just do that really quick right now. I'll show you guys everything I got and then just throw those together really quick so they're done. Um, my hospital bag is packed though. I do want to like take another shower stuff real quick even though I took one last night. Do a quick shave. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to take you guys along with me. So, um, let's go do the nurse's baskets right now. All right. So this is everything that I got for the nurse's baskets. So I have two baskets, one for labor and delivery, and then one for postpartum. And so then I got some energy drinks. I got four of them, some frappuccinos. Um, I also got this. I'm not sure if I'm going to put it in the baskets or not yet. We'll see. But I thought that this was kind of cool because it's like, sparkling water with caffeine in it and they're literally zero calories so as you guys are going to see in this haul I'm pretty much keeping it pretty healthy um got some popcorn some protein bars some gum um I got these smart sweets um these unreal little peanut butter cups I got some chapstick and I got some face masks so yeah this is everything I got so I'm just going to go ahead and Throw it in these baskets. I wasted all my time, I wasted all my nights, I wasted it on someone who's indifferent. It didn't love me right, he told me I was blind, but I never really wanted to listen.
All right, so here are the baskets. So I ended up not using the sparkling water at all. My baskets just are not big enough to fit everything, but I still think that it came out really cute. And then I went ahead and added a thank you card on the front as well. I just wrote, thank you so much for helping us welcome our sweet baby into this world. We are so grateful for all that you do. Love the Clarks. So yeah, I think they came out really good. Literally took me like five minutes to put these together if that. And yeah, so if you guys are needing some ideas for labor and delivery baskets, here you go. Somebody is awake. <gasps> Hi, baby. Good morning. Hi. Oh, did your little bobby pin mommy put in your hair come out? Yeah. What are you doing? Did you have a nice sleep? Yeah. We gotta go change your pampy. Go change your pampy and get some breakfast? No? <laughs> you see yourself? <laughs> You're so silly. All right, so Belle's finally awake. It is 8.04 a.m. She's already going in the pantry. I'm gonna go and get her situated and get her diaper changed and all of that stuff and start making some breakfast for her. Um, I don't know if I told you guys, Brandon headed out to the grocery store to go get the little bit of last stuff that we needed to get. So hopefully he should be back very, very soon so he can help me with Belle because when these contractions hit, I don't know how. I'm gonna be able to do with her, so yeah. Oh my gosh. You look nice, yeah. Yeah. We're gonna put some clothes on since we're not in pajamas all day. Ready? Ready? One, two, three. Breathe. more. One, mm -hmm. two, three. All right. Nope. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> you want a band-aid? Okay, I'll get you a band-aid. Here, here, here. Allie. Okay, mommy got to sit down. Okay, hold on, double. I'm having another contraction. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah. Maybe not. I just feel like so much pressure when I'm standing up. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wanna put some sockies on? Mm -hmm. No, we're gonna go make some breakfast. You wanna eat some breakfast? Yay. No. You want some pancakes? No. You don't want any pancakes? No, 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 Okay. All right. All right, forcing myself to eat some breakfast, but contractions are starting to come more frequent and more back to back, and I need to go get dressed, but um, just having some overnight oats um, with some bananas, almond butter, and honey, and I'm getting another contraction. Did you just move all the toys? Yeah. Hey, in her room, that rug needs to come up. Like anything that's on the floor, that pillow. I need to make sure I can still get in the closet. I'm gonna take a quick bird bath if I can, but if not, not, I'm, not. Bath again. not I'm not getting in the bath. I was gonna literally just rinse my vagina off. Not like running a bath.
trying to stay calm. Oh, I did not think this was gonna happen today. What are you doing? Huh? Oh. another one All right, another contraction, done. That one was 11 minutes apart now, so I think since I've been sitting and chilling and not moving, they're kind of spacing back out again. So I'm like, if I'm up moving around, they're coming more frequently. So if I can sit and not move that much, I'm pretty golden. All right, this is as good as hair is gonna get. I'm gonna do my makeup really quick all right we are in the car we are headed to labor and delivery right now my contractions are getting a lot closer they're getting more intense so we figured we'd go ahead and head in now just especially too because this is my third baby i don't know how fast i'm gonna go and i was already like almost three centimeters the other day so yeah plus i was losing more of my mucus plug and all of that so just to be better safe than sorry we're headed into the hospital right now yep this is a lot better than last time last time was a uh, not a, a great experience i mean it was a, it great, was a good experience, experience, was a great experience but, but just but not having busy. beds this yeah. time there's beds available for yeah. us there's no there's no rush or panic right now last yeah. time there was some panic yeah there was a lot of panic we didn't have any any time no you know, yeah we had to go from well first we had to because we live in an apartment, so we had to get down the stairs while she was in labor. So that was number one. Number two, then we had to drive to what Redwood City, which is Redwood 30. City. Yeah. yeah. So that was like just a long way out of the way, a long way out of the way from where we were originally supposed to go. And so we almost had the baby in the car. Yeah. Last time. Hopefully, so we'll see how. I don't. You know, we're not gonna have the baby in the car this time, but I'm really wondering how dilated i am if i get there and they say you're still a two or a three i'm gonna be like what the heck yeah then we're going back home <laughs> no we ain't i just don't want to be anxious to get no epidural or anything i still want to do this all natural so all right we'll check back in when we get to the hospital I'm here. Hi. How are you? Hey, hey. In labor. In labor? Okay. Um, I'll take you back. And then, in the, did you have a schedule? No. We called ahead. Okay. All right. So, Dad, go ahead and. All right. So, we're we're here. We just are about to check in, and uh, I'm excited. I think we're both excited. I'm sure we're both excited, and a little nervous. All right. So they just took us back to triage. Jennifer's over here. In the bed. Yep, they took a urine sample and told me to get undressed from the waist down and now we are waiting, but these contractions are coming back to back. Alright, I'm gonna put you on the monitor. Okay. So we're gonna do 20 minute tracing. Oh, see how the baby is. Check your cervix. Oh. And go from there. Did the contractions pick up when you started laying down? Um, they pick up when I'm standing up, so but they've been that's, I've had probably like four of them since I've been here. Oh. Oh. So, what do you think, Dad? Boy or girl? I'm pretty sure it's a boy. I had this dream before oh. before we found out uh -huh. of a boy, a baby oh. boy, and then we found out. But she sure does have a boy looking belly. It looks like a boy belly. Yeah. What? Okay, I'm gonna be quiet. She wants me to shut up when she's uh, having contractions. Oh Amazing. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh. I have to keep my mask on, right? You know, you don't worry about it. Okay. You can do what you can do, okay. right? That's what I tell my patients. Just you do what you can do. You're like in active labor, and, and you're asthma, and, you're gonna, and it's just yeah. Like, if you need to put it down, you okay. just do do what you need to do. Okay. All right, looks good. Okay. All right, let me get. So we're here, and uh, baby, you're inside of mommy's stomach. Not but, for long. But you're on your way out. So um, we will see you in a little bit. Okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Closer, way so, closer together now. Do you feel like you uh, wheelchair? We have three choices: wheelchair, this thing, or walking. I want to walk. I want to try and walk okay. so I can get some gravity going here. All right, get this. Um, you want an IV? Um, you don't have to have anything. Okay. Um, you don't want an IV? Okay. Just if there's an emergency, we'll start one quicker. Obviously, you know. Um, if you so, does that mean you don't want any pitocin when you deliver? Okay. Just me. Just, you. <laughs> Just you and the Just peanuts. me. Right, I'm gonna give you a quick room tour. Um, I'm not good at vlogging. I don't really know what to say. <laughs> All right, well, this is our room. It's very big, very spacious. It's nice, got a nice TV here. <laughs> nice, what is that, 20 inch? You can show them the warmer. Uh -huh. sort of the oh, wait, so this is where the baby is gonna be right in there. This is where Jen's going to give birth. Deliver. <laughs> right here in that section. This is where I will be. Probably, yeah. This is my bed. That's not your bed. We're not going to be in this room very oh, long. Oh, we're not going to be in this room very long. Okay. <laughs> this, we're going to move us after this. Okay. So this is just the first stop. Yeah. Uh, now, bathroom. the bathroom. There's a shower with a medicine ball and a chair and a toilet. Same thing you'll find in any bathroom. And here's the sink. Whoa. 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 Party clothes on. Mine was calling the baby nurse. Okay. Rinse. All right. I need to you ready, babe? Do I need to you ready to meet hands? your baby? Yeah. Do I need to wash my hands? If you want to, you're doing that. Hands. Whatever you feel like doing, it's your baby. Okay. I'm going to get my clothes on and then we'll break your water, okay? Okay. Because I think it's going to be right after. Okay. Hey. Hi. Okay. Hello. Um, you got this. Okay, quick okay. Right, right, right. I'm, I'm done, so. Yep. You know what oh, to do. Okay, okay. Come on, Jennifer. Push through. You're almost done. You're almost done. Come on, God. We're almost done. Come on. Come on. You're almost done. You're almost done. Push through. You've got this. You've got this. You've got this. You've got this. You're strong. You're strong. You're strong. You're strong. You're strong, Mama. You're almost done. You keep this baby. Almost. Come on. You want to stop on my I don't know right now. I'm okay. okay, right now. I just. Give me another. Six I just want her to break my water, and I can figure out what I'm gonna do. Uh, 
on your next contraction, uh -huh. if you decide to do a good big push, your baby's going to come out, okay? okay. Baby's right there. Okay. Yep. When you feel ready. All right. You're ready for what's coming. You are. You are, Mama. You're going to show us this baby. You know how to give birth to this baby. Reach inside. Find all your strength. Go for it. Good. Good. You're so powerful. Oh, cool. No. That's just a baby head coming out. You're all right. You're all right. Yeah, that's just your baby's head. Keep going. For all of this, that's yeah. Good, keep going. Hey, and um, well, we're going to be having you pretty soon. Um, there's... Whoa! Oh, 
Okay, you're involved. Yeah. You're bleeding and stable, great. Jennifer, okay? okay? Can I look at your bottom yeah, one quick yeah, second yeah, to make fine. sure you haven't torn? Yep, just drop your bottom. I'm gonna piece real yeah, quick. Yeah, lovely. All right, let's get this wet stuff out from underneath here. Did I tear? Nope. Not yeah. even a scratch. Congratulations, Thank you, you so guys. Much. You're incredible. Your family's so She's opening her eyes. She's opening her eyes. Hey, hey, hi. Hi. Can you put the blanket back on top so she can hold? She's already latched. Can you cover more of her body up here? Yeah, I hate that she has no name. Yeah, it has good I can't even feel it. I don't know what to call her, but yeah, she's already latched. Well, now we can look at her. Oh Name my god, Brandon. <gasps> you are so beautiful. <laughs> hey. You're okay. Hey, who are these people? Hungry? the dark. Just sitting there sunbathing under that warmer. You like that? Six pounds, seven ounces. Six pounds, seven ounces? No way. Six pounds. Well, it's bigger than Bell and Doug. Wow. Like that, perfect. Okay, you guys. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you. This is my baby. This is my baby. <laughs> hey, boy, girl. Oh, yes. It's so light. It's so light. I like it didn't cover all the way. Look at your little baby girl. Who has no name? Don't need someone to save me. No, and don't come running. 